What's going on guys? It's Asher here. Uh, today I've got a quick video for y'all. We just bought some Gov LED, I guess RGB string lights. I think these normally retail for like right at hundred bucks. I think we paid 73 on an Amazon deal. Um, gonna be a pretty quick little video, just putting them up and seeing what they look like. Our lights on our back porch that we put on our little uh, gazebo, they went out and we wanted to replace them with something that we could kind of utilize for Christmas as well. But you know, 95% of the year, we can keep them on just a warm bulb. And then whenever the holidays come around, we can change them all from the comfort of our phone. So follow along, we'll take a look at these. These are really a tester to see if we want to do the ones where you put it on the soffit all the way around your house. Cause they're like considerably more expensive. But uh, they say that they're shatterproof and dimmable. And I just took out the old ones and shattered several of them. So it'll be interesting to see if these are actually stronger. The packaging is pretty nice. Um, from all the videos I've watched, Gubby is pretty good at that. So I guess we'll break this open, see what they look like. Straight to it. Looks like just a whole bunch of lights stuck in a box. Um, sure enough, nice little power cord there. So these aren't hardwired to your electrical. They'll plug in just like a typical Christmas light or patio light would. Then we got some directions and whatnot on the bottom of the box. First thing first, let's get these plugged up in the kitchen before I take them outside and hook them all up and then them not work. Um, yeah, I mean, first impressions, they look pretty nice. So I've just got these plugged in. Um, I guess right now they're just on their warm light setting, which is what we're gonna keep them on 95% of the time. And they look pretty good, they're pretty bright. Uh, I guess that's just on off and then I guess I assume everything else is you know done through your phone so I'm about to download the app and then we'll check it out right now I have it on some mode that's supposed to be with music so anytime I speak it you know connects and does some kind of crazy um it took me like five minutes to sign up for the govy home thing and get it to work uh as far as colors go there's just a ton. You can control every single bulb, whatever color you want it to be on, which is pretty neat. Um, I don't know. It, it kind of looks like the possibilities are endless. Welcome to my back porch. Um, look at our little dog. Um, so this is the gazebo we're gonna put lights on. A lot of people, you know, would like hang the lights from the house to, you know, all that. And, that would look pretty good. But we've already had lights on this before on the inside and it, it looked really nice. Um, so we're not gonna try to reinvent the wheel here, but we're just, we should have enough footage to simply go all the way around the inside. Yeah, I do that. So here goes nothing. It's super windy today and I don't, I don't really know why, but uh, yeah, follow along. So what Rachel's doing, we're basically just zip tying them equal distance apart. We're gonna wrap it all the way around. <laughs> Rachel thought she could hide from the video. All right, um, so we have got these lights up. Let me flip around the camera and show you. Um, it's just 25 bulbs. We wrapped them all the way around over and over and over until there was no room to go. Um, it's daytime right now, so you can't really, you know, they're not gonna look like much anything. So later this afternoon, I'm gonna grill and then I will show you some of the modes as it darkens and yeah, catch you guys later. What's going on guys? It is a officially sunset here and uh, I'm just gonna show you what some of these lights look like. Uh, Rachel's gonna run through some of the settings 
and kind of just give you a demo of what they kind of look like before it gets too dark. All right, Rach, run us through some settings here. So we are on the recommended color schemes. So you have to pick your style, your basic color. Style, it has like refreshing, retro, elegant, modern. And then you just pick your basic color out of that style. So let's just say we go pink. The scene, I put it as joy. And then I just had it select contrasting colors. So then you just configure a color scheme and it creates a party. Then we can go into scene. So let's say we do night. This is a night scene. This is moonlight. This is spring. Aurora. Ooh, deep, deep. Oh, that's kind of cool. This one's called the Bower. And we have Ripple. Also cool. So then you can go into DIY. And then we can do Mode. I don't know. This is hard. It's not hard. <laughs> Music. So now we're on where when you talk, as you can see, when I get louder, the lights light up. So you can Or you can talk really loud. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Okay, then you can do rhythm. So this one is gonna move a lot more rather than go off just like small sounds and big sounds. This is spectrum. So I guess it creates like a haze. So. <laughs> and then rolling oh that's cool it does like rolling is like kind of like reminds me of a concert or something it kind of does it's very vibrant um it's definitely a vibe you can turn your sensitivity down if you want to but i like it being super super sensitive all right before it gets real dark we'll do it you know we'll do another sample when it gets dark before it gets real dark we're going to play a song and then you guys can kind of see how it goes to music. All right, now Rachel's going to play a song and kind of demonstrate how it goes to music. All right, three, two, one. Alright guys, it is officially dark outside. Um, overall, honestly, the possibilities are kind of endless as far as different color schemes you can do. Um, you can even like pick your favorite sports teams. They have like all the NFL and all the NBA. Pick your team and you can go to the exact color and you can put it up. Um, so it's pretty neat. You can literally just about do, I don't know, there's a lot of options. Uh, Oh, also the, the syncing with the music feature is actually super cool. I can't show you too much of that because uh, YouTube won't let me play my own music. So you're kind of just gonna have to take my word on that. But uh, yeah, I mean, that's it for $75 or whatever. I don't think you can beat this. I will say the only negative, I personally don't think it's as bright as just like normal standard um, like lights you could get anywhere. But uh, I think I'll, I'll take it being a little less bright for all the options I have. Um, anyways, guys, please like, subscribe, comment, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.
one last thing guys stay tuned because i am gonna do the thing um i'm gonna buy the ones that you put all the way around your house and i'm gonna put those up i'll make a video about those um sometime in the near future i'm probably gonna order those maybe tonight so it may be a week two weeks but that'll be pretty fun to watch thanks guys